Hi, welcome to another edition of Ask the Expert. I'm your expert, Andre Noel Potvin, president of InfoFit Educators. Often I hear this term, functional training. It's a term that is now widespread in the uh, training and conditioning of the world of personal training. And it's really a term that I wanted to clarify a little for people. Functional training or conditioning really means training the specific movement patterns that are re relevant to your life or sport. That means if you lift grocery bags out of shopping carts or babies out of, out of uh, strollers or your golf bags out of the back of your car, why not train specifically to protect yourself when doing those heavier lifting positions? Okay, so let's look at one common thing that people do in offices or at homes with their water system. They have water coolers, so you have this big heavy water bottle, and I mean this thing weighs quite a bit. And so how do we go about lifting it? Well first you have to be able to know how to squat down. Now this is great. They have a handle here on this water bottle. I'm sure you can see that. So this makes it easy. You squat down, you grab the top of the handle, you grab the bottom of the handle, and then you squat up. Now you still have to get it high up. So you have to learn to do an arm curl, but that's not gonna be easy with that much weight. So you learn to put the movements together by squatting and thrusting up to your shoulder. Then you just take a step forward, put it onto the cooler, and then you're all done. So that's the movement. Here's the training exercise. So here we are, we take a dumbbell, we place it down so that our hands just grip, take two hands like so, turn sideways, squat, pull up to your shoulder, then down, then up to the other shoulder, and then down. The idea is to get as low as you can, thinking about sitting on a very low chair. And then as you do this, let your arms go straight, and at the very end, just flip them. So you use the momentum of the squat in the lift to move the object. Then, once you've practiced that for a bit, hold it there, and then take a step forward and bring it down. Then down, squat up. So you learn how to do this lift with one leg in front, one leg in back. Squat, change the other way, down you go. Give that a try. That's a functional lift for the water cooler. See you on another edition of Ask the Expert.